Shalom brothers and sisters. So let's get this one out of the way quick. It usually triggers quite a lot of people um, and I'll give you some of my opinion on these kind of things. But interesting article. Here we go. Trump makes millions off his mugshot. The former president's mugshot and tweet, Never Surrender, are being offered for sale on a range of merchandise. Former U.S. President Donald Trump turned his mugshot into a particularly lucrative business. Less than two hours after he left the Fulton County Jail in Georgia, where the now famous photo was taken, his campaign's fundraising committee began selling memorabilia bearing the mugshot alongside the caption, Never Surrender that the former president wrote on his ex-account before and after he turned himself in. Among other things, the campaign offers t-shirts with the mugshot and inscription, cups, stickers, portable beverage coolers, plates, and more. The price of souvenirs range from $12 for a sticker, a sticker, to $36 for a shirt. According to estimates, the sale of this memorabilia will bring in millions of dollars to the Trump campaign that will help him during the 2024 presidential race. This is the multi-multi-millionaire that is now selling t-shirts, mugs and stickers of this situation to fund his campaign for 2024. So... I know a lot of people think he is the hero and he is the savior of America. And yes, in an argument, we can agree he is way better than Biden. But I'm not here to compare a left and right side of an evil system that is there to destroy. And I would just remind all of you of some of the things that he was championing and pushing really hard. Like calling himself the father of the vaccine and rolling it out faster than anywhere else. And all of the damage and hurt caused by that will just go there, for starters. And there's a lot more that I can say, but this is not a Trump bashing video. I'm just saying you should not be putting your hope in Mr. Donald J. Trump as the savior of America. He ain't saving nothing. He needs to get himself saved and in line with Jesus Christ and sort out the things that need sorting in his life. And that is just as it is with most leaders in the world today. And again, a lot of people don't want to hear this, but it is the truth. He is not your hero. Your hero should be Jesus Christ and God. And they are the only one who can come and change anything. And that is going to happen within the next seven years when Jesus comes back on his horse and sets everything right. That is happening soon. You don't need to buy any t-shirts, mugs or stickers for that event. It will just happen. So again, that's my personal 10 cents on that. I'm very hardcore about my belief system and my Bible. Even when a political party is really good on a lot of fronts here in South Africa, we've got people opposing the corrupt, pathetic people in government. But then they support abortion. I'm out. I'm sorry. I can't condone the murder of innocence. Because you're doing a lot of other things that are good. Because then my hands have the same blood that your hands have got. Or they're willing to cut deals with other smaller evil parties to be able to gather enough power to oust the evil party. You're already swimming with the rubbish. So again, I come from a hardcore stick it to the word 100% right side. There's only right and there's wrong. So yeah. Interesting. Millions of dollars in t-shirts, stickers, and mugs. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.